I'm not even saying the actual winners that compete in this competition, but the people that succeed in life, the people that they may have a better job or they may, they seem like they have the perfect lifestyle. They don't see, these people over here don't see this person's back in work. All the effort that it takes to get there, all the discipline that's required, and the work ethic to get where they are, all they see is a person standing up there on the podium winning. And don't be this person, guys. Don't be the hater. Don't be the critic. Be the person that just puts the work in, stays true to what they say they're going to do, finishes. And I promise you, if you can become that person, if you can practice those skills throughout these 90 days and apply that to your life, you will be that person in anything you do. And with that said, I'm more excited than ever for you guys to join me on this journey. So welcome to Summer Shredding.
just saying the actual winners that compete in this competition, but the people that succeed in life, the people that they may have a better job or they have, may, they seem like they have the perfect lifestyle. They don't see, these people over here don't see this person's back in work. All the effort that it takes to get there, all the discipline that's required, and the work ethic to get where they are, all they see is a person standing up there on the podium winning. And don't be this person, guys. Don't be the hater. Don't be the critic. Be the person that just puts the work in, stays true to what they say they're going to do, finishes. And I promise you, if you can become that person, if you can practice those skills throughout these 90 days and apply that to your life, you will be that person in anything you do. And with that said, I'm more excited than ever for you guys to join me on this journey. So welcome to Summer Shredding. What's up, you guys? You just saw my transformation for Summer Shredding, my three months of um, before and afters, weights, and you saw how the scale went up and down, and I lost 10 freaking pounds, which was super, super awesome. I feel so accomplished and so proud, and um, I'm just coming on here at the end of this to uh, just let you guys know, you know, kind of what my plans are and um, what's going on. I am recording this like two weeks after it actually ended. It's June 17th, is Saturday. It's June 15th. So. Um, upcoming plans are the 17th to the 25th. I'm going on vacation for nine days. I'm going to Colorado for my first time, which I'm super, super excited. My boyfriend decided he wanted to bring me because he's been before and um, he knows how beautiful it is. And his family and everything lives in Florida, so where else were you going? Where are you going to go? So um, Colorado is kind of our place that we want to go, and I'm super excited. I've been counting down the days. Um, but uh, so plans for me. Um, I have decided already to implement in a diet break uh, because I have gotten pretty low calorie and um, cardio and training has just been very, very strenuous. And so, of course, on vacation, it's going to be a vacation. Um, I'm not going to, you know, fall face first and a dozen of donuts and go and eat, you know, like a burger with all the toppings and mac and cheese and pizza and all the delicious stuff. I am going to indulge each day but I'm gonna make it smart and not make every single meal like 2,000 calories. Um, so, um, but I have decided to implement a diet break and um, I started it on Monday. The reason why I started it this past Monday um, and I'm gonna do it 14 days is because I don't want to, you know, keep depriving myself with, of food and um, stressing myself out, you know, keep killing it in the gym and working super, super hard. Um, I wanted to be able to start relaxing um, and giving my body a break early because it's better that I have some leeway that I'm used to a few days before vacation rather than going on vacation and then wanting to eat everything. Um, so I decided to slowly but surely bring in some calories and just start enjoying and trying to like not think about numbers, not think about calories, not trying to put in my fitness pal and I didn't realize how hard it was going to be until I started trying not to do it. Um, but it's one of those things I have to work on. Um, and I'm glad that I also added in more calories because my body's like, whoa, Nelly, you're eating so many calories. My digestive system is not ready for that so I'm gonna purchase some digestive enzymes because I definitely need some of those um, because who wants to wake up I've woken up three days in a row already bloated um, just uncomfortable and I know it's because I was eating super low calorie and now I'm giving my body a bunch of calories and I'm not making that many enzymes to digest my food so it's trying to work overtime um, and I'm trying to drink my apple cider vinegar, which is so freaking hard because I hate that stuff, but I know it's good for me. I take a 50 billion probiotic. Um, but yeah, pretty much update. Going to Colorado, implementing a two week diet break in. I will still exercise, but I'm not gonna force myself if I don't want to. I'm, I'm gonna relax. I'm gonna try and intake some yoga and um, meditation while I'm in Colorado because we're gonna be in a little cottage in the um, back out there in the mountains. So, mm. I'm going to just soak it all in and I'm glad because the whole time we're going to be there is going to be beautiful. I'm going to take you guys with me. Um, it's not going to be, you know, vlogging strenuous every single day. I might do it like three day increments because um, there's nine days. So then I, I, you guys can get a little, I'll get memories and then you guys can see like, you know, this is my, my journal, my journey, my diary. So I want to put 
my activities and memories and all the stuff that I go through on this channel so I can look back um, and then just so I can show you guys because I, that's just what I want to do. I enjoy it. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, but then right after I get back from Colorado, it is going to be back on the shreds game. Um, I haven't hit exactly where I want to be at. I still have some body fat percentage that I want to bring down. Um, but once I get there, then I will slowly reverse diet up and start focusing on building muscle and um, building my strength up, you know, having new goals and setting new goals. But right now I, um, I'm just going to enjoy it. So good all in, enjoy the vacation. So, um, after rambling and trying to tell you guys what I wanted to do and what I am doing and the plans and the future and now and, mm, I am going to end the vlog, enjoy some food, start packing. Cause I should have started packing a long time ago, but I'm going to start packing now. Um, Two more days of work and then we will be on the plane. Gotta leave at 3 in the morning and then um, our flight is at 6.30. And it'll be my second time flying. First time flying was only 45 minutes. This time I'm flying, it's gonna be three hours. So that will be fun too. Mm -mm -mm. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing, you know, my body transform and how, you know, see how I lost 10 pounds. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed the summer shredding uh, series but it's the end of it now and we have bigger better things to accomplish and crush and mm, so i don't know i'm just so excited okay i'm gonna go you guys i hope you enjoyed the vlog give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you want to see more of me see my colorado trip see wherever i go and i'll see you guys in the next vlog bye, bye.